Hi everyone, this is Syrian Girl. I don't know if you've seen the news, but apparently, according to Sky News and The Guardian, I am a robot. Cue the music. Now that that's over, let's get to the serious part. I am not a robot, I am a human being. I bleed red, but I assure you that I'm not an android and I was not sent over here from an alien civilization to inform you that your news is fake. You know, when I first started doing interviews years and years ago, an old crackpot made a YouTube video saying that I was an android and basically everything I was doing and saying was fake because somebody was controlling me from the outside. And I never thought I'd see the day that the mainstream media and the UK government would basically say the exact same thing as that old crackpot. But I shouldn't have been surprised because they're basically just as credible. They didn't even bother to talk to me. They didn't even bother to check my Twitter account before they wrote about it. The fact that there's a blue tick against it means that my identity is verified. I mean, they don't even think. They don't even think to question the government line. And yet I am the robot? You know, and I, I'm not alone in this. <laughs> so many people have been referred to as Russian bots and they're just real people who are dissidents and they're sick of the lies of the media. Another guy, Ian56789, was included with me in the article as a Russian bot. And he's a real person. They will dehumanize you to this level. I am basically not a human being according to the media. The mainstream media does not regard me as a human being. If they are capable of lying to you about the fact that I am a human being, what else are they prepared to lie to you about? They don't want you to know the truth about Syria. They don't want you to think that I exist or I'm a real person. They don't want you to know the truth about Salisbury or the false flags and the fake news. But I am here and I am alive. And so long as I am alive, I'm going to be seeing to it that you get to know the truth.